In this video I am going to discuss environment legislation and various acts of India. Watch this video till the end. As it is very important to learn and protect our mother environment to maintain sustainable development. In our constitution of India it is clearly stated that it is our duty to protect and improve the environment. It is mentioned in article number 51A and 48A. Article number 51A stated, the duty of state to protect and improve the environment and to safeguard the forests and wildlife of the country. It is added in Constitution of India in 42nd Amendments, 1976. In Article number 48A of Directive Principles of State Policy stated, state shall endeavor, protect and improve environment. The Department of Environment was established in India in 1980 to ensure a healthy environment for the country later became the Ministry of Environment and Forest in 1985. Indian Environmental Legislation Acts divided into four categories, namely 1. General List, 2. Forest and Wildlife List, 3. Water and 4. Air Category. The Environment Protection Act of 1986 came into force soon after Bhopal gas tragedy on 3 December 1984. Bhopal gas tragedy was a gas leak incident at Union Carbide India Limited, it is a pesticide plant in Bhopal. Environment Protection Act of 1986 is considered as an umbrella legislation. The act covers all forms of pollution. It provides the safe standards for the presence of various pollutants in the environment. It prohibits the use of hazardous material unless prior permission is taken from the central government. Currently, the maximum fine that can be imposed on a polluting industry or other entities is 1 lakh, along with a jail sentence of up to 5 years. This too requires the government agencies to first file a complaint with a magistrate at the district level and secure a favorable order against the polluter. Hazardous Waste Management and Handling Rules 1989. The objective of this rule is to control generation, collection, treatment, import, storage, and handling of hazardous waste. In 1991, the Public Liability Insurance Act is introduced. This act provides immediate relief to the persons affected by accident while handling any hazardous substance. In 1997, the National Environment Appellate Authority Act has been created to hear appeals. In 1998, Biomedical Waste Management and Handling Rules has been created to streamline the process of proper handling of hospital waste, such as segregation, disposal, collection and treatment. Stay tuned for my upcoming videos on various acts to control water and air pollution. And acts for protecting forest and wildlife.